Craziest rumor you heard about yourself? Craziest rumor? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I don't really hear rumors about myself. <laughs> You're not in the rumor mill. Yeah, I don't want to hear it. Now, why is that? Because sometimes I interview a person, and they have a lot of rumors about them, but here you are, and you don't really hear any. Because I don't really associate with a lot of people, so it's just kind of like me and my five fingers. <laughs> mm. Are you antisocial? Kind of. Where do you think that stemmed from? Um, I don't know. I've kind of always been like that. Not, not in a mean way, but I've always been shy. So people take it as like, oh, she's mean, she's this. So I usually just be by myself. Now, how long have you been in the modeling industry for? Since I was 17. And care to share what age you are at this point? 22. Okay. So mm -hmm. about five years, give yeah. or take. And is it a certain category of modeling mm. one would put you in or no? They just use the, the phrase model. Model, probably. I was I started off print and commercial because I was signed with LA Models. But after that, I just been modeling. What happened with LA Models? Nothing. I was in the um, teen division. So as I got older, I decided to not do it anymore. And that's when I decided I wanted to do music. So I was like staring away from it. Obviously, I still do Instagram, but I like as far as like print and commercial, no. When it comes to the teen division, do mm -hmm. you have to legit be a teen to be in that division? Or are there some people that turn 20 or I, 21? You do have to be a teen because once you're um, 18 or over, I think they put you in the women's division ah, if okay. you want to be or if you like go for it. Because I imagine some people look younger. Mm -hmm. than their Maybe with age. acting. With acting, you could be playing a team for sure. But Now, how are you in the modeling industry for five years mm -hmm. if you're a shy person? It just fell in my lap. I wasn't like pursuing it when I first moved here because I moved to Cali. Well, I moved to Cali from Oklahoma. So when I moved, my mom had told me and my little brother to go to this audition and we went and we just got signed out of nowhere from that. So it wasn't really like, oh, I'm pursuing something and, you know, but it just happened. Mm. Are you still shy to this day or has that, uh, you overcome that? I've overcame it. Was it a turning point when you overcame being shy, something specific in your life or was it just gradual progression? Um, I just would talk to myself every day like, okay, you know what, we're not doing this anymore. <laughs> yeah. You know, this is out. And the reason why I ask that is because there might be somebody watching this that's just shy, as you mm -hmm. described, and maybe they don't want to be shy. Maybe mm -hmm. they want to overcome that and don't know how. It is hard overcoming it because it's like it's just something that you can't control. It's like, you know, like a, one of your senses, like you can't control it. But I don't know, like me, I would just pep talk myself and like try to do something that I wouldn't do, stuff like that. And you obviously do music as well. Mm -hmm. And you also do acting. Mm -hmm. uh, I would find, I would assume that would be tough if you were a shy person. Yeah. But when I get into like my mode, I don't be playing. <laughs> and when it came to you be shy, when you, and when it came to you being shy, did that particularly stem from something? Mm, I just always been shy. I was probably the only shy one out of all my siblings. I was going to ask that next, mm -hmm. if that's, if you were the only one in the family like that. Yeah. So everybody else is outgoing and things of that nature, they're the opposite? Everybody has their own personality for sure. Mm. And you being shy, you were also the quiet one, mm -hmm. quote unquote? Yep. You would, you would have a lot to say maybe in your head, but you, it just wouldn't come out? Mm, I wouldn't have a lot to say in my head. I'd just be, I don't know, I'd just be chilling. 